Hey, okay, so just wanted to share this with everybody. Um, easy way to cut up or cube up watermelon for the summertime to get it all in the fridge and not waste any. Um, start with your watermelon. Um, I already sliced a few layers off just to have some slices with my meals. Um, makes it a little easier because you can get in there with the knife, even if you have a long knife. Um, so unless you have a short watermelon, this one is, let's see if I put my wrist down, about halfway up my forearm, just to give you an idea how tall it is. So at any rate, um, what you're going to do is you're going to slice into the flesh of the watermelon. There we are. Both vertically and horizontally. But you're going to go in like this, all the way down to the bottom of the watermelon. Be back in a second. Okay, so I'm back. So take a look at this. Can you see the lines? You don't have to be exactly perfect, but go all the way to the edge. It's pretty easy because the rind really slows down the knife, and you can feel it hit on the bottom and against the sides. Okay. Next up, slicing. I suggest using a cutting board Only because a lot of times it'll start to fall out and you don't want it all over the counter. Um, unless, I guess, you've cleaned your counter for the purpose of prepping food on it. But I suggest using a cutting board. Okay, so at any rate, so all you need now is a container to put your watermelon in. Thinking this one isn't going to be big enough, but that just means I'll have to eat some. So, got my dish, got my watermelon. Now I'm going to tip the watermelon up on its side and cut it down the side, just, I don't know if you saw that, down the side, yes. <laughs> um, just like you would to cut it into quarters. Okay, hold on. And just like I said, as you cut into it, it'll just start falling right out. So you, that's why the cutting board's important. All right, wanted you to see that. I'm gonna get this clean up and uh, show you the end product. And for any of the watermelon that gets stuck along the edge, like that, just take a knife and just like I did, run it along the edge and they'll fall right out into your ever-growing pile of watermelon. Okay, so <clears throat> after just two slices, I filled up my <laughs> entire container. So. That's going to have to go in the fridge, and then I'm going to go ahead and I just wrap the top of the watermelon with some saran wrap, and that's going to go in the fridge. But it's already cut, so now all I have to do is pop it out, take a couple slices, and I can fill up my container again. So a fairly quick, fairly easy way to cube or cut up watermelon. Hope you enjoyed.